can see hotel. Amazing how they get this stuff, huh? <laughs> yes, it is. So, uh, now Bob is going to be the narrator mm -hmm. in, in the role of uh, Susan Johnson, is, uh, uh, former stewardess. She's described as a former <laughs> stewardess. Mm -hmm. You are the former uh, stewardess. She told uh, The yes. Globe how she enjoyed two steamy afternoons of love with the 66-year-old football legend. Frank, you bastard. Uh, <laughs> in, the ro uh, in the role of... Uh, Kathy Lee Gifford, Christy Lee, uh, <clears throat> and uh, sound effects man, Dean? Uh, uh, yeah, Mark's pouring wine. Oh, okay. That's enough for me, thanks. <laughs> How about you, sir? I'll have more, honey. I could use a drink in order to do this. <laughs> All right. Uh, Bob, go Dad, ahead. Dad, I'll need some help with the smooching sounds. Oh, yeah? At 2.30 p.m. on April 30th, Frank arrived at Susan's suite. She led him into the main room where they sat on a sofa. Have a seat. How are you? Actually, I'm kind of having a tough time today. I'm not feeling so great. You look terrific. Yeah? Well, you look fantastic. I've had about half a bottle of wine. <laughs> <laughs> I've got some wine. I have water. I have coffee. Oh, then I'll have a cup of wine. By the way, it's 2.30 in the afternoon. <laughs> yeah, yeah, really? He's already had half a ask for a glass. You want the whole cup? Should have used that mm -hmm. coffee mm -hmm. tea or mean wine? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Susan had ordered Gergich Hills Chardonnay. I think that's how you pronounce it. Mm -hmm. A white California wine and a tray of cheese, crackers, and fruit. <laughs> this is absolutely my favorite wine in the whole world. <laughs> You're not just saying that because you want to get laid, are you? <laughs> that is Wait not true. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. We're right back where we started last time. <laughs> my line is, cheers. It's been a long time. They made small talk, mostly about their families. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> <laughs> right. She mentioned her children and grandchildren Monday. from her husband Harold's first marriage. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Frank was keen to talk about his daughter Vicky, who was divorcing her husband, Michael Kennedy, oh, yeah. after he was allegedly caught with their teenage babysitter. Then they talked about her work. <laughs> then they talked about her work. Hey! Then they talked about, about her work. work. Oh, my line? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, what are you doing? Well, I'm doing my hotel consulting, of course. I, some stained glass work. And Will you read the script? Stained glass. <laughs> <laughs> Little crocheting, maybe? Uh, I'm cross-stitching. I love my uh, cross-stitching. Yes. And I'm doing some planning for a hotel developer in Pennsylvania. Frank recalled phoning her over the years. <laughs> That's why I called you there. You called me in State College? No, 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 no. It's not a question. It's a yeah. statement. You called me in State College. <laughs> is that where Penn State is? <laughs> yes, you moron. <laughs> Frank, say moron? This is Frank Gifford, football <laughs> legend, professional broadcaster. You think you know where one of the major, major universities <laughs> football in football colleges? Yeah, Penn I'm State thinking. Say. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, it's in Pennsylvania. Penn State. I was born there. <laughs> I think he's nervous. See? He's kind of yeah. trying to make Maybe conversational. I don't know if you remember, <laughs> but I got Penn State tickets for your former secretary, who you also slept with. I sent her shit. <laughs> <That's not laughs> <in there. laughs> Check. I sent her champagne. Frank. You know what? I didn't realize you did that. You're kidding me. You're like a Melrose soap opera character. I've had a lot of fantasies about you. You have? Nice ones. Ooh. Oh, you mean the fantasies. Well... Susan. <laughs> ad -libbing. Would you stop ad-libbing? I thought you meant my yabba. <laughs> now, what later. is your line there, Susan? Yeah? Susan changed the subject. Blah, blah, blah. She talked about the time she tried to get Frank to join her on her business associate's 120-foot yacht. If this yacht's rocking, don't bother now. <laughs> she said she had wanted Frank to bring Kathy Lee so she could meet her. I don't think I can do that. My wife would probably hate you. Oh, I've heard that. She hates everyone. <laughs> oh, you read the GD script? When I had that in mind, I wanted both of you to come down. I can charm her. I doubt it, Could you? Yeah. Then Frank moved close, took her in his arms, and kissed her long and passionately. Now, see, wait a second. Can we, could we stop? For some, <laughs> could we stop for some, some, for some text analysis? Yes. Here? Well, they say they've deleted and omitted some things. They oh, I know, but that. I mean, it seems to be that he actually makes his move right after discussing his wife. <laughs> yeah. Well, hey, so well, well make her feel good. Maybe Kathy Lee still turns him on. Okay, well. All right. I was there with yeah. her. All I was thinking about was you. Mm. Okay, you ready okay. to continue? All right, here we go. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. time, baby. I uh, and he kissed her long and passionately. 
Oh. When some... Uh, All right. Hey, sound effects. <laughs> I can't talk and be long, passionate kissing at the same uh, time. Kissed her long and passionately. When someone like you comes along, it's very intriguing. It doesn't happen for me like that. It's not fantasizing. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just attracted to you. I told you that. You make me feel so good. Oh, I'm embarrassed and wet. Check. Not in there either. It does not say <laughs> wet. Read the text. She's a little more Susan, to the text. You can be replaced, you know. <laughs> How about some cheese and crackers? <laughs> <laughs> That's what she said. That's yeah. what she says. Oh That's what she says. Did that put some cheese and crackers? Yeah. I'm in there trying to help. <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. so maybe she is a little nervous. Well, she's too. always heard that the quickest way to a man's heart is through his stomach. Well, we don't know how she was Lord. serving them. But I mean, he's... <laughs> He's just, Would he's you like some cheese? <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter? Don't you have a bowl? <laughs> oh, that must be that, that must be Volvi. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> oh, oh my like God! God. Uh, cheese and crackers. <laughs> we might want to write that. <laughs> right here, Volvi. Please write it, Frank. Don't write those. now. Write it down at the end of the show. We may need that later. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. Where was uh, I? Susan Sweet. Than Volvita. Susan oh. said, I'm embarrassed. How, How about, about some, some cheese? cheese How about some cheese and crackers? Now, see, this is the part that I don't get. It's like <laughs> we're having two different conversations. Then Frank says, No, this is the part that's going to get Frank in big, big trouble. No. He's, he's just, said, a, he's big just said he's attracted to you. Then he goes, Put a big pause for that dash is. I've got to figure out what I'm going to do with you the rest of our lives. Ooh. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> So that came right after the cheese and crackers thing? Yeah. Wow. So he's I'm, talking about, obviously, it's that the implication is he wants, he wants to, to keep dump doing Kathy this. Lee sure. and keep keeping yeah. with her. And yeah. I think we should take off into the sunset Bombardier. and grab some native boys. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. It's and dot, dot, dot. And? And then I go, and what? I'm sorry, Frank goes, and what? Go to New Zealand? New Zealand? Yeah, someplace nice like New Zealand. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Bali or... See, you, so you've got to stick to the text because you, you can't make it funnier than I know, it is. That's true. Read it straight. Yeah, someplace nice. Maybe Bally. You have such pretty eyes. Frank jokes, they're both blue. <laughs> Jeez. He's a funny Good one, guy. Frank. And what's more pathetic, Susan laughs. <laughs> they are blue. But I mean, do you have contacts in? Yeah. You have fantastic legs, by the way. The compliment caused her to squeal with delight. <laughs> It is not a pig squeal. Like I re <laughs> repeatedly have told you, it's, you, you need kind of All like one of these, squeal. like this. Mm -hmm. All right. the, that's ooh, not a squeal. That's not a squeal, that's a moan. Need more of a... <gasps> the compliment caused her to squeal uh, with and delight. And squeal like... I, I'm excuse me, wee. excuse me, this is a very important could part we have of the text here. Christy, could we have a squeal, please? Go ahead. <gasps> <laughs> excited. Oh, that was good. Can you just do that whenever you want to? I got to read it. Wow. Wow. You don't need to be. Oh, wow. That's Jeez. impressive. Uh, Could okay. you do that again? Oh, a little more high right. end on it. We'll have Christy. You do it on the, uh, when I give the, uh, the uh, line, okay? The compliment caused her to squeal with delight. <gasps> oh, yeah. I'll be back. Come here. Come here. Oh, shit. Sorry. Keep going. Jeez. Frank was playing with his National Football League Hall of Fame ring. <laughs> what a loser. <laughs> he took it off and slipped it on her finger. Is that some kind of a sports hooker? I don't uh, know. Yeah, really. But that sure is woo. <laughs> with, with this ring, I the... It looks better on you than it does on me. We need a plan, said Frank. We do? Uh, uh, yes, we need a plan. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> You'll be here two more days. I'll come back. I'll call you in the morning. You're going to be here in the morning? I'll just find out what I have to do. He led her to the door, took her in his arms, and kissed her, letting his tongue explore her mouth. Come on, boys, we're going in. His, his hands roamed down her back, then fondled her behind and breasts. They glanced at their reflections on the closet door mirror. You have no reflection, good. Frank. <laughs> You're a vampire. <laughs> he is not a vampire. Good happened. Read the text as written. Now you got an X Files, am I right? <laughs> yes, oh, wow. yeah, yeah, the whole story. story. I'm Read sorry. the script as written. <laughs> Susan with a Z says. You would have been replaced many, many <laughs> rehearsals ago. Susan with a Z says.
What a nice couple. No, the next line. Was, yeah. <laughs> you can't do it with a straight face, see, can you? This is like a bad bumper sticker you'd see in California. It says, let's keep you and me between you and me. Yeah. With that, <laughs> Frank the homo left for a business appointment. Susan was in turmoil, wondering whether she should keep... <gasps> <laughs> Whether it, she was in turmoil, <laughs> but the whole time though she knows this is being videotaped, right? Susan was uh, in turmoil, wondering whether he would keep his promise to return. Like, if he doesn't yeah. show up, I won't get paid. She spent a fitful <laughs> night tossing and turning. I'm masturbating. Finally, <laughs> <laughs> finally, she decided that he wouldn't call back, and she wouldn't see him again. <laughs> but Frank did call the next morning. <laughs> wow, she didn't wait. She didn't worry too yeah, long. Really. Yeah, really. Yeah, the next morning, night. he said he had a hectic day, but that he'd like to drop by later for, uh, in quotes, coffee. Wink, wink. He arrived before 3 p.m. Again, she had ordered wine. Mm. Bunch of drunks. Hello? <laughs> Have a seat. I, I, I've been in, I've been out. You're in. You smell so good. I did put a dash of something on. I believe it's called heart. May I? <laughs> <laughs> Do not spray Do that not stuff spray in here. That crap again. <laughs> 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 I did put I did put a dash of something on. It's called old whorehouse. <laughs> <laughs> Not either. You're ruining this. You're like, ruining this this play. <laughs> Calvin Klein has gotten together with the Bumblebee people. <laughs> Bumblebee tuna. It's called old tuna. Mm -hmm. And I did put a dash of something on. Yeah, ha have a seat. I ordered this up. Susan pointed to the bottle of wine. My secretary asked That's me. That's enough. Thank you. <laughs> Excuse hey, me. When I, when I have wine, I lose control of my bladder. <laughs> Now we can pour the wine. I'm sorry. Oh, oh. I'm not sure I can finish the play now because our, our theater our theater smells like whatever that crap you spray is. Oh, oh, that smells horrible. It's traditional oh. Bayberry. Oh, mm. oh. Sorry, I wet myself, Frank. Do you still want me? Frank, I get back to the test. We'll leave it to your test. line, Frank. My secretary asked me, where are you going and what are you going to do with her? <laughs> This, wait till I read it. Oh, sorry. This made Susan laugh. <laughs> so my question is, Frank has told his secretary that he's what a go see this girl? going to stoop the stories? Uh, sounds like it. Dumbass. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Didn't tell anybody, huh? Did no. <laughs> she didn't mean anything by that. She meant, is this business or whatever? They settled on the sofa. <clears throat> Frank took Susan in his arms and began kissing and caressing her. <laughs> The television was on, and Frank suggested they order an erotic movie on pay-per-view for the TV in the bedroom. Now, see, and this is this is a this is a type a touch that we really haven't expounded on. How's that? Underscored enough? Yes. Mm -hmm. What the erotic movie? Yeah, you know, Frank's here in the in the you know, I guess the with suite room. With it makes it dirtier. This woman who he's had phone sex with, evidently, up earlier in the story, it says they've been carrying on since 1993 on the phone. Maybe I'm too curious, but I'd really like to know what they were watching on TV. I mean, because it says they just clicked on the TV. What do you think was on? Let's! Hey! A deal! Oh, no, it was probably <laughs> Regis and Kathy Lee. Lee. Oh. No, it was mm -hmm. three Flip in the it. afternoon. So well, it's on uh, different been. times, oh, different no. around right, the country. It's syndicated. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, that could have been. That would be funny. When, oh, there's your really awkward. Okay, uh, Frank suggested they order an erotic movie on pay-per-view for the TV in the bedroom. Why don't we watch TV in here? What do you have to do tonight? I have a reception. Frank suggested she change into something more comfortable. Like nothing. She went into the bedroom. Susan had a hadn't brought a negligee. But so she, she, uh, this, this kills me. She hasn't brought a negligee, but she's got the wine. wine the cheese. <laughs> and she's got the video camera. And she so. knew the night before that he was coming back. She could have gone shopping. So she put on she? the hotel's terry cloth bathrobe. Mm. She returned, and they kissed some more. <laughs> Frank walked over to the closet to undress, and she went back into the bedroom. And when he followed, he was stark naked. <laughs> and act one. Oh, we have to take a break? <laughs> we'll be back with oh, act two. Hold on. Hold on a second. Yeah, we'll be back with act two. Hold on a second. From the Globe, once again, the, the text of the alleged Frank Gifford uh, encounter with uh, the stewardess Susan, S-U-Z-E-N. Mm -hmm. Once again, very suspect. Uh, Remember, in act two, you'll hear... <laughs> I'll get you a nice wet towel. <laughs> <laughs> act two... <laughs> oh, we hear the towel. Then. Oh, and you'll also Ooh. hear the, the the phrase, 
unnatural sex act. Uh, mm -hmm. Act two is full of spice. Mm -hmm. You oh, yeah. don't want to miss uh -oh. this. Okay, we'll be right back with act two. This is the Bob and Tom show. Okay, and that like stuff you? that the sound guy sprayed. It's those celebrity no. couples that are faithful anymore. Could we, yeah. could we move on now? Yes. Damn sound guy. We have to get uh, <laughs> the weather squeezed in here. and pack, mm. uh, We uh, have a little bit of sunshine on the way today. Way to <laughs> <laughs> Should pop out sometime this afternoon. Sure. Yeah, yeah, just some yeah, sound yeah. effects. Not that warm, though. It's only going to be about 70, 70. <laughs> and then as the week goes on... Uh, Right sound Ooh, effects, guy. Nice. Okay. Warmed cool. up. All Sounds like Michael Winslow. Kind of <laughs> only, <laughs> only funnier. Only better. <laughs> A couple of raindrops yeah. possible. <laughs> <laughs> All the way through um, Sunday. We have uh, tickets. In. in fact, we have tickets coming up in about five minutes for uh, our... Every day we give away tickets, uh, 9 to 7, and this hour is no exception. And uh, we'll have tickets in just a few minutes for um, Boston. Boston in concert, okay. We so should have had tickets. What? Anytime this hour. Okay. Anytime. It doesn't say it has Happy to be the first break. Spot, Mr. Anal. Eat me. You have to be, <laughs> if, he, if, if he ate 15 doesn't come, do you well, fret all day? Get mm -hmm. Let's get it. We got free tickets every day, 9 to 7 in the summer of 97 on 94.7 Q95. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> This is the Bob and Tom Show. We are once again trying to recreate the, uh, the Frank Gifford tapes as uh, transcribed in the Globe magazine. Uh, or okay, we just tabloid. tabloid. I wouldn't call it a magazine. We just finished uh, Act, Act one. one with uh, Frank following Susan into the bedroom, stark naked. Okay, all right. Okay, Susan, pick up Susan. Is Beginning por portrait Act by Chief Frank Mitchell. is now totally naked. Yeah. Well, you should just come in here and take a nap, lay down, lay and down. relax. It says lay down. We don't correct the grammar. <laughs> 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 grammar Fine. There could be kids listening. <laughs> All right. Lay down and relax. A nice massage. Take this side if you want. Is the door locked? <laughs> I love that. I'm sorry. I'm doing a little text analysis here. Mm -hmm. Exegesis, as we call it. Mm -hmm. um, <clears throat> Frank, I wanted to do this since I met you. Susan? Did you really? You must have. I'm not sure. Oh, and if you're going to do that, I need to take a quick shower. No, <laughs> see, I'm you not stop adding to the script. Just read what's off. written there. You want to have All a quick right. snack. All right, I, I think we should have open <laughs> auditions for Susan. <laughs> oh, come on! <laughs> come on, Mr. Cavoy, and I can do better. Yeah, God. God. Well, let's try it. Real. Let's do it from the heart, up. huh? I could take a shower real quick. <laughs> You're fired, Susan. Fine. Let's, no, let's Susan. No, no, it's I'm funnier when you do. It. Oh God, this oh. is what I love. Dissension like on the set. Oh, no. I cannot work with that man. <laughs> <laughs> I am walking. This is like the real thing, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know who he thinks he is. He's your director. I am walking. Not, I thought he was the narrator. narrator. Walking. I thought he was the I'm, director. Narrator. I'm it's, it's, taking guff from the narrator. Wait until I of, call in, equity on you. You'll never of, work in this town again. Instead of walking, why don't you run? <laughs> oh, oh, Susan, okay. would you like Come to continue, on, I please? To see that, here you read that good line. There. Well, who's Susan? You are. Well, an apology would be nice. <laughs> oh, jeez. You're never going to get through that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Susan. I'm sorry, Susan. Read the Continue. text as written. Did you really? You must have. I'm not sure. I could take a shower real quick. You don't have to take a shower. I'm sure you don't, you know. <laughs> No, no, it's, it says, I'm sure you don't, you know. And I, they must have either taken oh, words out they or... They had to. I'm telling you. They begin to make love. Oh, wait a second. Oh, wait a minute. I know. She wasn't fresh. <laughs> no, no, no. But I, mean, I think she's saying, I'm sure you don't need to take... She's saying to Frank, I'm sure you don't need to take a shower. I'm sure you don't. Right. You know. Because he's so fresh. Uh-huh. I guess. No, you know. Don't think. They begin to make love. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? <laughs> sounds like you're on the toilet. Got a fireman hey, the hell? Uh, can you undo that trust for me? Only is sixty six. No ad libbing from the sound effects guy. Oh, are you gonna fire him too, Demille? <laughs> <laughs> they begin to make love. I don't. <sighs> I don't do this. What you mean is you don't do it very well. <laughs> it does not say I that. Know, you're ruining the mood. Wow, we were actually moving better. along and then Susan. Sorry, I'm sorry. I don't either. I really don't. So many cities, and I know that in football things go on, you know, like 
touchdowns and things. But what? Would I just, you stop uh, it? <laughs> <laughs> the comedy's already there. We don't need right, you to add lemon. I don't either. I, I really don't. So many cities, and I know that in football things go on. But I just, I don't know. Maybe because you're married. You are too. Here we are. You have beautiful breasts. <laughs> See, Frank is the master of the linear. Yeah, yeah. Really you know, is. she brings up the fact that they're both married, and he just looks at her breasts and goes, "They're great." And he, she thinks he's screwing women in every city mm -hmm. while he's doing the football thing. Now, are they still doing it here? Uh, I'm not sure. There's, sounds like they started, but they started. Mm -hmm. I think we have to rely on the sound effects guy. What's still. going on while he's saying? <laughs> 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 oh yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, then, Susan. Now this see this this line to me is out of nowhere. And Go it's ahead. stupid. Oh. After Frank says you have beautiful breasts, she says, "Oh, I wish I hadn't eaten." <laughs> <laughs> did she get like? Did she get like? Uh, did she get like pasta sauce on her I boobs? I mean, what? No. Oh, the narrator explains no, the narrator it. Will she clear felt self-conscious about her looks and laughed nervously. <laughs> <laughs> Not wickedly, nervously. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's bad. Ah, that's great. <laughs> Do you want me to rub your back a little bit? I can make you feel nice, too. You're beautiful. You wanted to be with me when you first met me? I wanted to hold and kiss you. Oh, God, that feels so nice. I can't even believe... Do this and we won't have to talk. <laughs> Shall we not? Frank wanted to commit an unnatural sexual act. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Frank. That's an exit, not an entrance. <laughs> but she right on down. <laughs> but she refused. What? So they began performing oral sex on each other. Oh, you're so big. <laughs> project. Oh, Susan, project. You're so big. <laughs> Susan. Oh, Susan. You don't need to take her We can't. <laughs> Can you do it without... That's my favorite one. Your mouth covered. <laughs> oh, God, that's so big. Oh, no. No, it's so good. <laughs> it's so good. I, I bet um, it tastes like this in New Zealand. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my, you're so big. I knew you would be. By the way, what are the, what's the name of the coach of Penn State? <laughs> <laughs> Is he the guy with the white socks and the glasses? <laughs> or is he oh, another Frank. day? So incredible. So could you, incredible. Could, we, could you turn up the stereo? Susan, start at the beginning of your line. Hey! Oh, God. Out of so they began performing oral sex on each other. Oh, Susan. Susan. Oh, God, that's so good. Oh, my, you're so big. I, I knew stop, you would be. Stop. I'm not doing this with any feeling at all. No, I got a technical question. <laughs> didn't do it. What's the technical question? How could she be talking if her mouth's full? <laughs> <laughs> That's why I tried to do it first, and nobody, everybody said no. Because Stop we couldn't, we couldn't they hear you. Christy. Well, you wouldn't hear me if I had it. You know, <laughs> Christy, I appreciate your directness. <laughs> it says they began performing oral sex on each other. I. Yeah. Began. Oh, yeah, they had well. Take a break. Yeah, look at Christy over there. So, uh, <laughs> all, all work and no play makes Susan a dull girl. Mm -hmm. So it's she just, talks a lot. So at this no time, th see, that was my technical question. If no kidding, <laughs> they've been talking for. Well, I saw I, the upside of this thing is now at least you know, it, you know, it would have been really bad if in this transcript she'd said, "Frank, wow, for such a big halfback, you." That's such a little penis. <laughs> <laughs> that that would have been. That. That yeah, that would have probably ruined the day, huh? Probably. Yeah. Here, you know, here at least no he's got. No woman says that to a man. Yeah, nobody's going to say that. Uh, no. Oh yeah. They're going to do that happy talk <laughs> stuff. Well, unless you're Rick Schrader's wife or whatever that guy's name is. <laughs> when you're inside me, I, I feel, feel nothing. nothing. <laughs> Most women feel for you guys. We're not going to say that, even if you. All are. right. Well, let's start back with Susan. Really? Do you commonly say the phrase well, "you're so Wait big," would regardless of the circumstance? You mean you uh, you to... speaking on behalf of women take pity on men? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> well, I want to know when this uh, performance became an open discussion. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, hey, Neil Simon. <laughs> How about the script a little bit. Okay, now start back with this is getting good. Oh, God, that's so good. Oh, okay. my, you're so big. <laughs> sure, I, I knew like you would be. Like that's right. Sure. I just knew you would be. Susan. Susan. Deep breath. Oh, Get your God. character back. Take the pen. That's so good. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> Take the pen out of your mouth. <laughs> 
I don't think that's. Aren't you a method right actor? Now. I like that. That's Susan. Small cold bird. Susan. Huh? Start. <laughs> I'm me. answering to Susan. As the, as the as the as the co-director. Oh God. Could I put it? So it's not good. necessarily to take the pen and ram it up and down in your mouth as you right. the lines. Give me. A big one, too. It's a big Sharpie. Oh, God, that's so good. Oh, my, you're so big. I knew you would be. I just knew you would be. Oh, Frank. <laughs> now, wait a minute. It's They're so incredible. Why is she happy that he's so big? So Where does it say sound effects guy talks here? <laughs> it, huh? does, it does not. Okay. okay. It does not. Then Frank says... No, wait a minute. The You're Frank. The music, the music, the music, Frank says We've the been talking so long, so long it's actually changed. Wait a minute, I like this. I like That's this cut better. No, music. no, no, no. Here we go. Got to keep the moment. Frank says, Now just kiss me, and I want to kiss you. He's doing that snowball thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> It does not say yeah, yeah, yeah. This isn't a yes, Beatles yes, song. Yes, yes, come yes, on. Yes, yes, yes. I, I know. I never would have thought that we would be like this. Or I would have sent down for something, maybe more cheese and crackers. No. Now, see, that's Even though they didn't have condoms, ah. they began having sex. She wasn't thinking ahead. She was thinking head off. Yeah, she'd been just doing it. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Condom ahead. Uh, even though they didn't I don't have understand. condoms. They're, they're trying to set up Frank. They've got, a, they've got a video camera. She knows this whole thing's being taped. you think she would have been prepared. That's well, all maybe I'm saying. Maybe she also enjoyed it. So. What if she gets pregnant? And, uh, and she's act two. 46. Jeez. Could happen. <laughs> Are we done on Act 2? again? You well, know you know, if we didn't have Susan ad-libbing... Uh... <laughs> I have to get into the park. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. If you want a performance, I'm going to have to stick this down my throat. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's necessary to get the feel of the park. Oh, I think I it is. During the break, like during right the break, <laughs> Chick, why don't you be responsible for getting the wet towel? <laughs> <laughs> Oh. We will uh, come right I back. I think it's interesting that F Frank um, makes such a mess. No, that he actually oh. asked. <laughs> that he, that I, that he asked, apparently right up front. There's not that much semen in the world, is there? <laughs> Uh, right up front, Frank wants to commit an unnatural act. Mm -hmm. Which, of course, you would... <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Jump right on. I want that unnatural Thank act. you very much. I'm, we're just guessing, we'll, uh, of course. We'll come right back with the, the final act three. Mm -hmm. You're listening to the Bob and Tom Show. The Bob and Tom Show. We are now in act three of uh, the uh, Globe tabloid magazine. They actually have the transcript of the alleged uh, Frank Gifford encounter with uh, former stewardess, as she is described here. Susan Johnson, S-U-Z-E-N, right away, a huge hint. Mm -hmm. You've got trouble on your hands. And now, it, it's, uh, apparently, she cooperated with this magazine and had them set up the cameras and knew this whole thing was going cameras, on. Cameras, tape recorders, whatever they got. Evidently. Yeah, that had to be pretty hard. I would think. Knowing that, ugh. Mm -hmm. ugh. All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Act three. <laughs> Susan. What, what are we going to say? Oh, God. Line? How can you always lose the moment? <laughs> yeah, kill line? Me. Line? Line? Your line is, should set it up. tell me how you like to be kissed. Oh, okay. All right? No, but no, but no, no, but no, but no, but no, but I think we got to set the context. Yeah, set, She's where you're at. Frank, oh, had, God. Frank, uh, Frank had <laughs> said, now, just kiss me, I want to kiss you. And then, Susan, you said, yes, 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 I know. I never I know, would have thought, thought that this would we would be like this, or I would have sat down for something, meaning she no, wanted to... Then, I don't know if you can call the concierge for condoms, can you? Even though they didn't have condoms, they began having Must sex. Be I bet you can. Yeah, sure. So is that what she meant? Set down, she would have sent yeah. down for condoms? Sent down for condoms. Uh -huh. You don't send down for condoms. Yes, Rubber 1203, please. <laughs> I, think she meant, I think she meant she would have had some kind of a, you know, tray. Front rubbers 1203. <laughs> tray of what? And be quick about it. Cheesy well, I think, I think she's a tray of what? Well, Food? I think she thinks they're going to spend the evening together now. and Maybe yeah. so. Well, All she's right. wrong. <laughs> well, let's We're get, jumping ahead. What do you say we get back to the beginning of Act 3? <laughs> All okay. right. Susan? Tell me how you like to be kissed. Like that. And I love kissing you. Mm, oh, you do that so good. I'm, I'm so, so attracted well. to you. <laughs> do not correct <laughs> the grammar. I, oh, it's just great on me. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> oh, Frank, I can't believe that you're doing this to me. Oh, that's so incredible. Frank, you're so wonderful. I, 
<laughs> I love it so much. Uh oh. Oh, you're so hot. Kiss my hot neck, Frank. <laughs> no, it's Frank. Just, stop. Frank. Kiss my hot neck. Hot neck. This is that? turning into mash. You got it. hot lips, Frank. Oh. No, then Frank says, No. <laughs> Help me if I'm wrong here now. Uh -oh. um, this means he's r about ready he's to about, reach the pinnacle. That's of, about it. So just read your line, Frank, and yeah. I think everyone will know where we he's are. He's about finished. Okay, so <laughs> here's what I want to know, I guess, technically. <laughs> After it says... <laughs> I'm sorry, it's not just me. <laughs> After it says they didn't have condoms, they began having sex, and then this little tiny bit of dialogue, and he says his line, is that the, uh, that's that the entire length of time? I believe well, so. They've okay. already been going been, orally. I, remember, this has been edited. Okay. Yeah. So they may have been... In, some other I mean, we're like, talking about 15 seconds, then Frank gives the line, I'm gone in two seconds, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Next, that's his line. He says, "I'm gone in yeah. two seconds." Yeah, two seconds. You know, and then, right there, black wow. and white. And then Susan says, "Do you want just a sip of wine?" And then Frank, apparently listening to the question, says, "You have beautiful breasts." Oh my God, Frank, you pervert! <laughs> no, she says, "Oh my God." Is he done by now? Oh, Frank. <laughs> Stop Frank. bouncing on the bed, Frank. <laughs> no. Stop patting your part, Susan. Are we post? No. No. Frank, we're not post yet, are we? Almost. Oh. Frank asked her for oral sex again. So I'm. So she's asking for, she want a sip of wine and he's two seconds from doing the <laughs> big I, thing? Yes. You know, I'd like to get this done before midnight. Well, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I agree we with Christy here. Right? I think they're holding off the big finish here. Okay. Yeah, yeah they're, they're just stretching right. things. Here we go. Ready? Okay. I'm Frank. My line. Stuff. Frank asked for oral sex. Oh, Susan, do it to me. Oh, God. Oh, God. They finished their lovemaking. <laughs> Boy, that was fast. <laughs> Susan. You okay? You okay, sweetie? Uh-oh, he's Did dead. Give me a crash cart. He's dead. <laughs> How do I dress a dead, dead man? Quick, somebody call Megan Marsha. <laughs> Obscure Rockefeller joke. Mm -hmm. C-70s history books for punchline. I'm sorry, Frank says... I thought about you from the day I met you. I thought about you so much. I just never dreamed that we'd be here with the honor bar. <laughs> <laughs> it does not say it would be here with the honor bar. <laughs> Hunter Bart's baby. <laughs> 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 right. Do you actually fill out the form or let the maid count? <laughs> You're ruining the part. Of Come on, Susan. Sorry. I thought about you so much. I just never dreamed. Oh, you don't even have a pillow under your head. Bless your heart. My head is fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get you a nice wet towel. Oh, please stop looking. Okay, now let's just analyze this. <laughs> he needs a nice wet towel. What is he just uh, volumes and spermerated <laughs> papers? And such I don't know. Exactly. Big liquid feet. Maybe he uh, <laughs> maybe he threw up on himself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I always do that. Uh, <laughs> now, I always do that. Now, ladies, ladies, I think, <laughs> ladies, I think I see a faux pas here. <laughs> what? 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 There's the mistake. In that. Now she says, "I'll get you a nice wet towel." Oh, please stop looking. So she's what? Is she embarrassed about her body? Yeah, yeah. Sure. yeah. yeah. And yeah, then he says, ass. and then he says, <laughs> oh, "You don't know if she has a big ass." Well, he says, what? he says, "You have such a great personality. You're so perky." Ouch. Shouldn't he? Shouldn't he? In that context, have said, "Hey, you look great." And Don't the, worry the last about thing it. you want to hear is about your you personality. personality. About your personality when you're worried about Makes your look. Snappy little dancer, and you make your own clothes. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad your ass is the size of a barn. No, that would be so romantic. I'm sorry, uh, uh, Susan. Pick up your line at the bottom of. Those. Listen to you. You are. Oh God. I mean, you're sexy. You're handsome. I love the way I feel when I'm with you. I'm very comfortable. I make a nice living, too. No. It <laughs> just says, says, I know. I know. From the moment I met you. Now let's spend some time with each other. I'll just find you. I've got the numbers. What's with the husband? We gonna run into him? <laughs> no. Frank began talking again about his daughter, Vicky. Blah, blah, blah. blah, 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 blah. And her wayward, wayward husband, Michael Kennedy. He's a smart kid. He really is. No. It's just he's an alcoholic. A year ago, he went into rehab and came out and never had a drink since. And never had a drink since, but he transferred the whole addiction to sex. Wow. 
You mean with other women or farm machinery? <laughs> Does not say farm machinery. No, it says. You mean with other women or just? Well, he wound up screwing the babysitter. Ouch. Then, <laughs> then he told Susan why she meant so much to him. Lie, 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 blah, blah, blah. <laughs> yes, yes. Sound effects man. Once upon a time. No editorializing from the sound right, effects man. Frank? Every now and then, I need to get away. From Kathy Lee. That's <laughs> you bastard. Excuse me, I... The way the line is written, Sorry. every now and then, I need to get away. That's what I saw with you. You know, we all need that to step out of our roles a little bit. Have you thought about Dianetics? <laughs> <laughs> Dianetics. No, it does not mention Dianetics. about L. Ron Hubbard. <laughs> I think oh, you have God. the same thing. We can help each other. Susan? I, I adore being with you. The way you touched me yesterday. The way you touched me when we first met one another. The way you crammed your all-star <laughs> ring. Hey, 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 It's the old oh. ham crew. I, I knew you weren't someone to go after another woman like you went after me. Frank, I have not been with another woman for ten years. Frank was referring to his time with Kathy Lee, whom he married October 18th, 1986. I told... Frank Darkenden. Which is says one of his friends. <laughs> Fill in the blank. I told someone that I had met somebody I really like to be with. I mean, walk a beach with or climb a mountain. Frank told her he had to be in Greenwich, Connecticut that night to co-host an event, but would call her. <laughs> Talk to me while I get dressed. I've got to go. I really hate to do it, but I have to. So where will you be? I always have my cellular. Just say, Susan, I'll know right away. And the lover's part. Happy trails <laughs> to you until we through the videotape. <laughs> until they published the transcript. Oh my God. Ladies and gentlemen, we proudly present. Yeah. Brought to you by Frank Gifford, Puppet Theater. Wonderful performance. We have to get a copy of this video. Uh, now you have to wonder if Kathy Lee regularly gives it to him uh, the unnatural way. Mm. Oh. Makes you wonder. Makes you wonder, doesn't it? Don't it? That was the first thing he asked for. Don't it? <laughs> I can't imagine. You know that Kathy Lee is reading this. Frank never likes me at home. <laughs> Frank, Frank never asked me to sodomize him at home. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the help. Yeah. They never asked for seconds in oral sex at home. Wow. Well, what a special, special moment. That's um, nice, Frank. And you know what's going to kill him more than the actual sex? Uh, his age. <laughs> no. no, this climbing on the mountain and walking climbing on the beach. Climbing on the mountain, walking on the beach. Mm -hmm. I bet he's, find I'll a bet. way to spe put you in my life. In other words, yeah, Kathy those Lee's are, heard those very lines. Oh, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He's kind of corny with his lines. Though, yeah. It's really kind of weird about it. Yeah. I, he says yeah. some goofy... Gee, and what a shock. After listening to his commentary on football these years, I can't imagine why his uh, lines in the sack wouldn't be just dead on. Yeah, they're kind of... Uh... Well, I'll take the telestrator here, and I'll illustrate what I'm talking about. I'm going to take this orifice, which ordinarily goes mm -hmm. here, and I'm going to cram this. But as you can see, we have the uh, defense. Ordinarily, well, this would be an offensive move. Mm -hmm. They're in a tight, tight defense. Mm -hmm. Well, I yeah. think this I think is we're the, officially uh, done. Eye formation. <laughs> 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 I say, say this, this, this is your generals. No, okay. We're out here. This is the motion defense. So long, uh, run up everyone. The <laughs> you're listening to the Bob and Tom Show. <coughs> oh, fellas. That's right, Dick. And we'll be right back on Q95 with that fabulous variety show, Dick's Picks. Picks.